the flames, star seeds, all of you that are joining me today. Thank you so much for being here. Welcome to your tea and tarot. Um, I am DG Tarot. My name is Stephanie and I'm going to be your reader today for your twin flame journey. Um, so it's going to be a little bit shorter today, but you're going to get just as much information as any other day. Um, so if you guys resonate with this message, please like, share, and subscribe to support the channel and look at the perks below in the description for when you do that. And there are also extra perks if you go and follow me on my TikTok where I have daily short readings for you and I do them almost every day so you get to see more of this every, um, every day throughout the week. So go ahead and follow me there. Um, also, I have my Teespring up, I have my website up, I'm working on getting everything put together. Um, but in the comments, guys, let me know what tea you are drinking today. I have my white tea with some caffeine in it, and I am drinking that for you guys today. Let me know what you guys drink for your beverage um, during these readings. Um, so appreciate you guys. You've been so supportive. Thanks so much. Re um, remember to follow the guidelines on the community commenting for YouTube, please. Been getting a lot of um, some really bad comments on here. Um, and I do appreciate, you know, like some um, things that you guys like, you know, just, just comments that are very light for this channel. So thanks so much. I appreciate you guys. I'm going to continue with some of the fast shuffling if it goes over a minute for a shuffling. And otherwise, I'll keep the shuffling in there for you guys. So Thanks so much. A lot of information in a short amount of time, but um, look at the description below for all of that, okay? Thanks so much, guys, and um, I want to get started pretty quickly today. Yes, and readings are open for personal readings on my Etsy shop, description below again. Um, they are open this week. I have some slots left, um, and all my readings are on sale over 35 and my decks as well. So, with that being said, we will start with the tarot, and I look forward to this reading with you guys. So, hope you had a good Mother's Day for those mothers on here, or for those who, you know, in general, celebrated. Oh, wow. We're already getting cards falling out. Page of Swords. Page of Swords. All right. So mental mental restlessness we have the eight of cups someone's working on walking away it did fall out in reverse i don't usually read them like that um but i feel like they're definitely working on walking away from a situation um walking to a higher purpose to new opportunities because they're restless so with their um energy here they don't want to be where they are they kind of feel stuck and they want movement so I definitely feel like um your twin is walking away from this situation for your divine masculine that's right yes this is on your divine masculine by the way for twin flames so seeing strength here and I see justice as well balance scales things balance karma balancing out here for the masculine so any situations that are open right now um, negative toxic karmic situations anything they're dealing with is working on being closed so the five of cups okay so um, pain grief um, this is loss regret sorrow um, so whatever is going on with your masculine, um, they're not, they weren't happy or they're not currently happy presently. Um, and they're thinking a lot about opening up a door to new opportunities, um, to follow through to happiness and fulfillment. And this pentacles here, this five of pentacles is some financial instability or just in general instability, um, not feeling um, not feeling like they can support anybody else right now, more just trying to support themselves. Um, left out in the cold, those kind of feelings come from that card, the energy of that card. Um, but look at this, they're going to build 
good strength again. The stability is going to come back for them when they exit this path, when they exit what is not making them happy. Fruits of labor with this nine of pentacles, okay? They're going to reap the rewards from the hard work, um, from walking away from what doesn't serve them to opening themselves up to what will serve them in this journey with the two of you. So, um, I mean, I do see some good things coming out of this um, departure from a challenging um, situation, a challenging relationship, whatever is happening right now, there is a loss, okay? There's going to be a loss for you and, I'm um, sorry, for them in their um, in their 3D world in life. Um, but it's something that they've been kind of thinking about walking away from for a while because they've been restless. They've been just really thinking a lot. They've been all over the place with their thoughts, trying to figure out a way to leave from feeling this void and feeling um, like they're in the dark and in the cold with this other situation. So they're building strength though. And there's that twin flame symbol for you there, infinity. Um, building strength and the hard work is going to pay off. All right, let's do our twin flame tarot. Divine masculine, please. Come on with the divine Wow, so a lot of cup energy here. Surrender, resilient, knight of wands, last stand. Taking that stand to find that, you know, that finality that will kind of help them to strengthen and move forward. Lots of cup energy here, so water signs out there can be connected or just in general, a lot of emotions for them in the connection. Okay. So um, nine of cups, content, wish come true, sensual love. So they're looking to fulfill a wish here. They're looking for a better happiness and contentment with life because they're not content where they are. So their wish will come true <laughs> in regards to these, these situations. And here we have the four of cups, deep regret, missed opportunity, sorrow, and remorse, exactly what we were getting from before um with with the energies so deep regrets loss missed opportunity a missed opportunity with you i feel like they regret it there's a lot of sorrow and deep regret for them choosing a situation that trapped them with this eight of swords so trapped manipulated and blocked they were manipulated um someone was blocking the path here karmic force karmic ties for your divine masculine and um they're seeking better possibilities and opportunities for true love and um they deeply regret that they missed the opportunity when they had the chance with you the wheel fate karmic cycles and destiny so yes that karma is going to cycle out okay the cycles are going to close and end they're going to choose the path to love is what i really feel like i just feel like they're so stuck they don't want that anymore star deeper man's hope and healing and wish fulfillment wish come true man you are just their wish come true their wish fulfillment they are trying to wish upon a star for your love for to come closer to you to be with you look at this the king of cups masculine energy companionship passionate love warmth and honesty they want honesty they want warmth and sensual love they want passion romance <laughs> that masculine energy is very close to you and they want to be closer to you. Ten of Pentacles, longevity, stability, wealth, and prosperity. So they're looking for stability. They're looking for the long term. They missed that opportunity to have that with you and instead chose this codependency. But look at this Ace of Cups, pure love, complete union and innocent longings. So you guys are going to come into... Um, 
this complete union and har harmony and wholeness, um, innocent longing, sensual, passionate love, warmth and honesty. I mean, this all speaks out twin flames and the DM and DF energy that happens when you come together. And here we have the Knight of Cups. They want to sweep you away. Whirlwind romance, love blossoms. So they want that love. They want that swept off your feet love. They want to come sweep you off your feet. And this has a lot to do with taking you by surprise. So you're not going to expect this at all, feminines. They're going to come in when you least expect it. They don't want to miss any more opportunities with you and have any more deep regrets. They're ready to leave this karmic cycle. All right. Let's get our twin flame separation. Four divine masculine, please. Two to feminine. That healing card, I swear, comes out every time. Secrets, I'm secretly, um, I'm secretly in love with you. So, secrets at the bottom of the deck here. And intuition, the divine is leading me back to you. Yeah, I can feel that for sure. So they are, they are still in love with you, no matter what has been said. Healing, your energy is healing me. So you are helping to heal your masculine. Your energy heals them, brings them closer to you. Separation, I miss you so much right now. So they're feeling that separation very deeply right now. Deep regrets, remorse, there's a loss over you. And they're healing, they're working on this. Oh, this is crazy. Transcending and ascension. I'm rising above my own form and I'm ascending to the next level. So your masculine is working on that ascension, working on healing and transcending what they used to be, ego, pride, um, head games, playing games, things like that. They are working on healing all of that, letting it go and becoming something greater um, for the connection. Fire, my very soul burns for you. Yes, they miss you. <laughs> the separation has really, really caused them to go deep within, has really caused them to heal, has really caused them to question everything and to deeply regret that they ever turned away from you and let you go. Let's get our pining rose. Hope you guys are doing good out there. If you're just now coming in, thanks so much. Like, share, and subscribe. Follow me on the TikToks. Whatever you like. All right. For the Divine Masculine to the Feminine, please. Oh, wow. I saw that at the bottom of the deck, and I did not know that that was going to come out. But I felt it for sure. Wow. Oh, my God. I'm having fantasies. Yeah, your masculine's having some deep fantasies about you right now. About having a life with you. About just everything. I mean, look at this. I'm curious about you. They want to know what you're doing. They want to know where you are, if you're with anyone. Um, your masculine wants to know what's going on with you, how you feel about them. There is a magnetic pull and attraction between the both of you, and they can feel it too. There is a um, mutual attraction, magnetic pull. They feel drawn to you right now. They're having fantasies about you in their heads, and they're curious about you. <laughs> in search of a wife. So I told you already, They this masculine, they want commitment. They don't want to play around anymore. Look at this. This is crazy. So looking to get steamy. Yeah, they're having so many fantasies about you. Things are looking to heat up and hit the next level between the both of you. They're feeling this incredible magnetic pull towards you. You're, um, you're in their thoughts. You're in their mind. They're fantasizing about you sexually, physically, emotionally. Just you guys having a life together, that kind of deal. And committing, Being committed to you. They're fantasizing these things. They're curious about you right now. They're looking to get hotter with you. But here's the catch. Don't be obvious. 
and think things through. So this tells me that they want this very, very much, but they have to be careful because of the fact that they are in, you know, another relationship for the um, better part of you guys. Um, the reason that you guys can't come together or just that there was a breakup between the both of you, they lost you, have terrible regrets and resentments towards that. They need to think things through before making an offer to you to get more steamy. <laughs> and they're trying not to be obvious about it. Maybe they hid a lot of their feelings from you and they couldn't make it too obvious because, you know, they can get in trouble or things could um, go kind of the not a good way <laughs> with, the, with you guys. So they're trying to be careful and think things through. But they're very curious about what it would be like with you. Um, having fantasies, that kind of thing. So they have to take this but in steps, which is why it's just taking forever. It's what, you know, it feels like it's taking forever. Let me try some angel, romance angel. fell out too many yeah separation look at that separation again time apart is on the horizon so yeah there's that separation look at that finance financial issues are a factor right now yes so they're having those financial issues we saw that with the pentacles the five of pentacles i want to say um there is a separation this is twice now this is twice it's time to disconnect from the world retreat. So they want to retreat from the world. They want to go away with you. This feels like a honeymoon type of thing, but um, yeah, they want to retreat. They want to, to get away, to um, follow, maybe follow their heart somewhere else. You know what I feel like with you. Um, sorry, I have to check the camera every now and then. Um, yeah. Finances and career are, are uh, a big a big block right now in the connection that you guys are in the separation period to take time off, time to get alone, time to maybe come together and be alone together. That's what I feel like they want. They want to be alone with you. And we'll get our DM to DF, spirit messages from the masculine right now. Yeah, so balance is a, and look at that, I'm missing you a lot, I long for you. Balance is really big right now. They have to balance career, money, fin finances, family. Um, there is a need for balance in them, which is, again, another block, something they're healing. I'm actually really close to you, but you don't know it because I want to get exactly right. I'm sorry to keep you waiting for so long, and I hope you'll give me more time to make these plans. Hold on tight a little bit longer. Your DM is making plans. If you stop your progress now or give up, the opportunity might be missed, and your DM can feel your hesitation and may turn back. It's exactly what we were talking about. They want, they're close to you. It's so close, guys. Don't give up hope. Um, they're sorry to keep you waiting for so long. I hope you give them more time to make plans. Like I said, they have to be careful. They can't be obvious about this, guys. They have to make sure that everything is going to work out in a good way. Find masculine 5D messages, please. Yeah, it's hard for them to make, they have to make these plans. And it's saying if, um, you know, if, they don't balance these things. If they don't make the plans right, it, you know, it might take longer to reach this. So they are trying. They're trying so hard to come to you, to come to union, to come to balance, to come back to this connection. Just is going to take some time because they're still dealing with some other people, some other energies, um, you know, the karmic ties, things like that. And look, um, what's at the bottom of the deck i um won't be able to keep myself from reaching out much longer that's right is they just can't i love you more than you're aware oh my god and i'm sure of your feelings for me 
so they don't know how you feel they don't know if you feel the same way as they feel especially maybe with how things got left off before or how they left you or, or whatever happened in the situation um they weren't they weren't completely honest. They hid their feelings from you. Um, they love you more than you're aware. They do love you, um, but they're unaware of how you feel about them. And they, they just, they won't be able to stop themselves from reaching out much longer. They want to talk to you. They want to be with you. They're having fantasies, things like that. Curious about you, about what's going on. So that's incredible. That's beautiful. Guys, <laughs> that was an amazing reading. I mean, I feel like those updates is just like so much of what you need for this week. And I hope it starts you off well. And um, again, let me know what you're drinking and uh, in the comments. And don't forget to follow me. Follow my TikToks, um, go to Teespring, Etsy for personal readings decks that I have here. Um, thanks guys so, so much for supporting me. Um, like, share, and subscribe if you resonate. And I really look forward to next time I see you for another tea and tarot or for the general message. Thanks so much, guys.